beaches and other shore facilities. To justify how the new segregation laws and new and emerging consumer rights discourse that African Americans are using uh, in their complaints to uh, regain access, whites use notices as, as an opportunity to reaffirm their commitment to free labor ideology by branding African Americans who lobby for integrated leisure as public enemies of capitalism and, under, and as a result undeserving of recreational time and space. An editorial in the New York Times uh, complained that, quote, the colored servant who calls on Bradley to maintain God's beach depopulates it of every paying Caucasian, forcing him into the abyss of bankruptcy and dooming this hotel to tumble into a ruinous wreck of live slap wars and Indian red shingles. Another citizen of Bradley's community and what often would also could have probably been adopted as a resort's unofficial slogan declared, this is a white people's resort and it derives its support from white people. So as a white people's resort, middle class tourists marked black citizens who sat beside them or insisted on opportunities to engage in leisure on beaches or boardwalk as evil. Evil was a word that constantly uh, propped up. Uh, one quote says the unidentified, uh, one unidentified hotel man observed that on the trains from New York and Philadelphia, as well as on the seats of trains and depots, the sides of black factions seem to regard themselves as owners of all below the sky are offensive and indecent. A reporter for the Philadelphia Inquirer similarly noted uh, that ever before has the town seemed so overrun with the dark-skinned race, it's easy to see what an evil it is that hangs over Atlantic City. 